Hey people, how are you? In this short video, I am going to talk about a very very important feature in PowerPoint which is called as presentation view. Alright, let's say I have two computers. I mean I have the main computer you see here. This is my laptop and I have another monitor screen you see at the back. You see here, this is my monitor screen and let's say both of them are connected. So I have used a VGA cable to connect it. Now let's say that you want to have more control over your presentation then you can go to presentation view. For example, you see here if I just show you I have written something in this notes right. So I have written that presenter view gives another option to present in a different way. The presenter has extra control on the content and blah 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 alright. And what I want is I don't want to show this note to my viewer and I want to see the notes while giving the presentation. So for that we have presentation view alright. So let's say if you will be in home so let me just come here if you will be in home right now what you have to do is you have to go to slideshow here and then you have an option you can see here at this moment you see you have an option of use presenter view all right so if you just check this option now you see this option is already checked at this moment so if you just check this option and now what you do is you just start this presentation now let me just start the presentation so i'll just give shift f5 on my keyboard now you see here on my computer screen i'm able to see this that is this is my main screen I mean this is my main slide and here I have some other controls so you see here here I can have laser pointer I have pen highlighter then ink color and so on similarly you see here I have so many options right and then towards your right you see here it can show the notes as well so let's say I want to read from the notes that is here it is written presenter view gives another option to present in a different way and the presenter has extra control on the content he can see the notes and he can see the next slide what is coming in etc right so you see here this is the next slide which you can see here and this is the monitor so you see here if i want to show the monitor to my viewer i can show only this monitor while giving the presentation I will be having full control over my presentation. So there are a lot of options which I can do here. You see here at top I have show taskbar. So if I just click here you see at the bottom we have this taskbar. Let me just close this. Similarly I have display setting and we have end slideshow and so on. So this is a very good feature which you can use in PowerPoint. But the viewer I mean the end user will be only seeing this particular slide. You see here, if I just want to show this monitor screen, you see, which is behind my laptop, they will be able to see only this screen. So this is very good if you want to share only the monitor screen and if you do not want to share your main laptop screen. All right. Another point which I wanted to tell you is that if you go to your laptop, you see, if I just give right click, you have an option of display settings. Here if we just come down you see you have multiple displays option right and under this you see you have duplicate these displays or you have extend these displays. Similarly you have show only on one or show only on two. Now if you want to duplicate whatever you have in the laptop screen on your monitor then make sure that you have selected this duplicate these displays right and once you close this now you see here now if I just open my PowerPoint let me just give shift F5 so that it will open from the current slide you see I'm able to see a lot of things on my screen because this is presentation view while on the monitor screen you are seeing only the particular presentation and they are not able to see these areas for example next slide then these are part of notes then at the down you have a lot of things 
So these will not be visible to the viewer, but they will be only able to see this main slide. All right. So make sure that you just go to your display settings. So here you go to display settings and make sure that this particular option is on that is duplicate these displays. All right. So that's it in this video. Take care. Bye.